Welcome back, nice to see you again. In this step then, as I promised, we are going to look at sorting out our outliner. So the first thing I'm going to do for that is just make it a bit bigger so I can see what I'm doing. So I'm just going to resize my windows a little bit there. And we've got to sort these into folders within the outliner. I'm going to start with the floor. So I'm going to get static mesh floor one, which as we can see is that one over there. I'll just press F. There it is, look, that piece there. And then I'm going to get all the way up to 20. Now, because we duplicated them to the ceiling, that goes beyond 20 now. But I know that the floor only goes up to 20. So I'll select all of those. And then there's a little folder icon up here. We'll click on that and that will create a new folder and put all those meshes in it. So if I just collapse that folder now, you can see that those meshes are in there. And then I'm going to rename that folder so that I know what's in it. So right click, go to edit and rename. And I'm going to call this one subfloor. Nice. Okay, next what I'm going to do is get all of these pieces. So these are called floor mesh. So I'm going to get the first one. I'll find the last one. I think there are 80 of these. There are. So hold shift, click on the last one. I've now got all pieces of that floor. So click on folder. I'm going to rename that to floor. And then I can collapse that folder. So I've now got two folders you can see this is now starting to get much more sorted out next I've got the other floors but these ones are up here so they're actually my ceiling so I'll select all of those pieces new folder rename the folder edit rename this one's going to be called ceiling and then we'll collapse that and then I want another one for walls essentially so we've got back wall We'll include the door frame in this one as well. The trim can go in there as well. All the walls, wall panels, yep. Wall sci-fi. So that's all of those. So I'll create a new folder for that and I'm gonna call this folder. So let's just rename walls and door. And then collapse that. You can see now I've got very little left, just the lights basically. So let's select all of those. We'll put those in a folder and we'll rename it. And this one is going to be called Lights and Effects. Now we'll collapse that. And we're going to leave the player start out because that's a gameplay thing, really. So I'm not going to put that into like level folders. And then we can do one more thing just to really organize this, uh, ready for if we have more levels later, is select all five of these folders, put them in a folder, and this folder is gonna be called, um, what's it gonna be called? I'm gonna call it Storeroom, like that. And then I can collapse that down to just one folder and a player start. So that is how we organize our outliner, and we're done. Yay! So we've got one more step in chapter two, which is just to have one more pass at the lighting. We're going to polish that a little bit, make sure that the lighting behaves as we expect it to. And uh, we're doing pretty well. We're making good progress. So um, let's, let's move on to the next step. Thanks for watching and supporting the channel. If you'd like to help me create more content like this, please consider becoming a patron on Patreon. The contributions I get through Patreon make a huge difference in keeping this channel going. Remember to like, comment and subscribe to make sure you don't miss my upcoming tutorials. Your support and engagement mean the world to me and help my channel continue to grow. Thanks again, and I'll see you in the next one.